Well, my office is essentially responsible for programs, strategies, uh, policies that seek to reduce risk on the Jamaican population, to also educate them about, about the this, this subject of disaster risk reduction uh, and management. But also, more importantly, we play a significant role in coordinating what is called the Western Sub-Regional Mechanism mm -hmm. under the Caribbean Disaster Emergency Management Agency. So essentially, facilitating response coordination to the countries within the sub-Western, sub-Regional, Western Sub-Region, and also looking at joint programs that can be embarked upon between the All right, uh, Ronald, how are you integrating climate change and disaster risk? Well, we are, we're essentially what we've done is formed a, a thematic working group that brings the two communities together. And this is very important to ensure that there is there's no wasting of resources, that there is a common agenda as it relates to climate change adaptation and disasters production, and that essentially that the country can build this resilience program that it seeks to achieve by integrating all of the two concepts, principles, and actors. And what about investments? How you are promoting investments? And if, it's, uh, um, if investments are public or private investment also? Well, both. Um, I think what we've, we've sought to do is to bring all the actors together, the private sector actors, along with the government actors, to look at the, the main priorities. And in doing that, we are promoting private investment both in terms of the private infrastructure itself that is owned by the private um, operators but also contributing to government's programs, priorities and interventions such as infrastructure works uh, and, and also um, you know, the hotel sector which is, which is very important to, to our economy. And uh, Rana, how many members are in Sidima? Sidima is made up of about 18 member states and you know, we have um, Haiti as a, a, a non-English speaking member yeah. state and Suriname, uh, which is to the far south, which is which is. Dutch. And between these uh, countries, these members, uh, which will be the most prepared countries? <laughs> well, the most prepared countries. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I I'm not asking who, uh, <laughs> which are not prepared, yes. right? I would definitely say that Jamaica is one of the, the countries that would be one of the most prepared, along with um, I, I would I would definitely put in there the British Virgin Islands, uh, and and perhaps Trinidad in terms of the resourcing and the ability to, to be able to mobilize and, and provide support to a number of other countries. And uh, yeah, are, are you able to provide support to other countries, for example, in the case of Haiti? Yes. Um, in the case of Haiti, there, there certainly was bilateral support from Jamaica to Haiti, but there was a much bigger um, regional cooperation um, later down, which was, which was mobilized and coordinated through the Sedema mechanism, but through Jamaica into Haiti. Did you support Haiti in the big earthquake? Yes, we did. Um, yes, we did. But that, that also defined for us as Sedema um, the rules of engagement, working with a country that is so large, as is the case of Haiti, with, you know, with, with deficits in terms of the capacity to deal with risk reduction and looking certainly at you know, what are the lessons coming out of, out of that response that we had to, to get involved with. To, to sort of define exactly how we're going to go forward with building the capacities in Haiti and also supporting a regional response to countries within our system such as Haiti. Uh, Ronald, what, finally, mm -hmm. what do you take of this platform? Well, I think it's very important. I think it brings an opportunity to, to share experiences, uh, to share lessons. I wouldn't necessarily say lessons learned because we only learn them when we apply the lessons and they turn out positive, but certainly to share lessons, share experiences, and also to network and to look at how jointly we can address some of the, the, the problems which we, we all face within this region and this hemisphere.